Hello everybody, my name is Axe Factor, and this is Skid Loader Superiority over on Dice LA CTE servers on the PC side. It's the holiday season, and that means Dice usually breaks out crazy stuff. So why not put a bunch of Skid Loaders on the top of Siege of Shanghai and ram them and jam them? And as you can see, we have proper body positions. Everybody looks like they're taking a nice, happy, healthy dump. Some people's shoulders have been broken in half, and their arms are pushing backwards, saying... Don't ram me, bro, as I go off the side. So obviously the name of the game is to PTFO, get on the flag, push the teammates off, I mean the bad guys off, and try to stay on the map as long as possible. And baiting people is actually a must. So we're actually going to use these poles as I kind of save it there, pull up, and hopefully he can't push me into the side here, giving my don't push me, bro, broken shoulders imitation there as we kind of... All are so there's multiple variations these are very glitchy and that's what makes these fun you can't exit your vehicle here no you don't have a secondary gunner or third guy in the back but when it comes to rolling dirty on the Jeeps this one's extremely glitched out uh, you can second seat you can third seat you can RPG it you can reptile it you can drop sandwiches off the side and sometimes you can actually exit the vehicle it happened a couple times and I think it had to do a friendly C4 in your own Jeep to kill the friendly or you just get ejected like that, and away you go. So that guy gets a double dose of the RPG. And here I try to spawn on a friendly outside. And, uh... uh, e uh, uh no dice. And back into the beep beep jeep we go. True leave style. And there you see some of the friendly C4 going off, but that's okay, because it's easier to kill the beep beep jeeps with the RPGs and, of course, the fleek of the Reese, which we're going to have right there through the fence. I actually banged two of the guys out, and it's still going strong. So that's not your style, right? How about some snowmobile superiority? You could be the secondary guy on the back with your RPG straw, small C4, gunning, and pro tip. Don't go too fast, because this is really, really hard to aim. And just in case you miss the objective on any of these maps or any of these modes, that's a blimp. I mean, if you're, if you're not in tune with the new mini-map awareness thing with the actual capture point highlighted, maybe a blimp will help you out. And, of course, the points on CTE are just nuts. So it's kind of fun rolling around with an RPG on your shoulder, but you got to be careful. Especially if you hit your own teammate and do half damage to you. And 10 points from the Russian judge on this landing. Trying to shoot through his brain matter to get the bad guy in the flag. But don't worry, you can actually get off of this thing. So lots of hilarious moments on snowmobile superiority. As I managed to get a shaky aim kill on Zim. So probably the coolest mode besides the other ones is actually tank superiority. Right? There are LEVs, there are tanks, and people can get out. You can't have a repper, you can't have a secondary gunner, and this is not the setup that I would rock. This is seriously Boogeyman 4, Boogerfield 4, with uh, that right there. I forgot to check my settings in CTE, and there's a whole bunch of nonsense going on there. But this really harkens back to Battlefield 3, minus the tank destroyer. There are three flags, and of course, if you're clueless, there's a blimp, just like that. And the name of the game is Cat Two of the Three Flags. Put the ticket bleed on them, and away you go. So you can spawn on people on flags. You can cat flags as infantry. You can get out. You can rep. You can snipe. And believe it or not, we actually did see a rock sniper in CTE, which is crazy because there's barely any people in the server. But it was a blast. Check out the CTE servers on PC. Don't know how long this hotness is going to be up, but it was an absolute blast banging around in some absolute glitched out crazy game modes. Don't forget to check this stuff out. Hopefully you guys enjoy your Halloween holiday no matter where you're at in the world. Thanks for watching, checking me out, and we'll see you guys soon.